Everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Timmy Trinkle, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And my next movie review is Fire with Fire. This movie was released on November 6, 2012. It is an action thriller that received mixed to negative reviews from critics. It has a 5.6 out of 10 on IMDb, a 7% on Rotten Tomatoes, and an 82% on Google. Don't know what the budget was for this movie. I'm sure it was probably pretty high, and it only made $2.4 million at the box office. It was directed by David Barrett and written by Tom O'Connor, and it has a great cast uh, starring uh, Rosario Dawson, Bruce Willis, Josh Dumont, and Vincent D'Onofrio, along with Quentin Rampage Jackson, 50 Cent. Um, this movie is about a fireman uh, Mike, who, uh, not Mike, excuse me, uh, Jeremy, who is portrayed by Josh Dumel. Um, he witnesses a crime and basically he has to go into witness protection um, and under a new name because the guy who he witnessed uh, committing a crime was David, uh, played by Vincent D'Onofrio, who is a powerful um, a gang leader. And he's fighting off other gangs, um, the East Side Crips, and uh, there's just a big old feud between some of these uh, groups or gangs. But he witnesses the crime. Uh, two cops, uh, one Talia, played by Rosario Dawson, and Mike, who I mentioned earlier, played by Bruce Willis, are doing everything they can to protect this man. Um, that's what this movie is about. Um, Going into this movie, I had high expectations, uh, mainly because of the cast in this movie. And this is supposed to be an action thriller, and there there was a lack of action in the movie. Uh, it just I, I can't imagine what the the budget was for this movie. It's got to be at least I, I would say seventy five to one hundred million, uh, if not more. Uh, just for the salaries alone for those guys, uh, especially Bruce. But, uh, yeah, it's uh, this was kind of a dull uh, action thriller, predictable. Uh, and just it's not very action-packed. It was just, I think the guys were just, you know, throwing in the towel like, yeah, okay, we're doing this movie. Yeah. The, the, script was, the script was bad. Um this has so much potential to be a great movie, but I think the casting was wrong. Uh, putting um, uh, Josh Duhamel uh, in that role, it, it just didn't work. Uh, had they flipped the script and had Bruce Willis uh, be that guy, I think the movie would have been much better. Um, because Bruce, he's just a great action star. Josh, he's... I don't know. It, it just it just wasn't a good movie. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to think of some nice things to say about it. Um, the only thing I can really say is I like the cast, uh, but the performances were subpar, and the movie was just kind of dull. And I understand why it only has a 7% on Rotten Tomatoes. Uh, this was very disappointing. Um, so, with that, I'm going to give the film Fire with Fire a 5 out of 10 and two thumbs down. And uh, that's being generous. Uh, could have given it a much lower grade. Uh, but because I do like the actors in the movie, and some of it was actually decent. But for the most part, this was just a boring, almost two-hour movie. So yeah, I give it a 5 out of 10, 2 thumbs down. In the comment section below, if you've seen this movie, give me your thoughts and opinions. And, you know, let me know, did you like this movie? Did you hate it? Uh, let's have a great discussion about this movie. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe today for more content. If you like this review, hit that like button. Other than that, stay tuned for many more movie reviews. I thank you guys for watching, and check you later.